Hi, this is Dan. Welcome to part two of my Duskers weekly challenge for week 33. Uh, we only visited two ships in the uh, first episode, but uh, they were both a little bit time consuming. They're both A class ships. Um, haven't really run into any trouble yet, happily. And um, Vinny, welcome aboard. Probably means we're going to. retire Matt soon, and I think because Matthias W is awkward to say, and he always starts his videos with this is Matt, we'll just call him Matt. Um, yeah, so turns out that, that LB, when he was uh, getting the auto trader set up and stuff, also named all the drones for um, daily challenge players that we play with. And, um, also, it would appear named auto traders for, uh, for some of the others. So, we've already visited Fax Tolger's Exchange. Is there another one in here? The Knock Shop, that's good. And... Absurdum's Emporium. Those are all good names. Props props to you, LB, for those names. Uh, we are probably not going to go to a shop this time. Don't think. I don't want to use up the only other military A that we have. Because I've already gotten rid of the Justice Rider and we're flying around in the Hordeca. But, um, Metalloid is a nice goofy name. I. The Wild Stallion. Stallion, probably. Um, is a deeply, deeply stupid way for that ship name to be spelled. So I don't really want to go there. And we want to get to the space station because the space station, I mean, fuel depots almost always have, have fuel in them. Space stations are less likely to, but I still think they're more likely to have lots of jump fuel than, uh, than other places. But we, have, we may have limited jumps here. But uh, let's go to the Metalloid next, and then we can do the Vagrant... And then over here, and maybe the Red July. Yeah. And how do I feel about this loadout? I feel okay about this loadout. Um, maybe we'll need a reroute power. I kind of doubt it, but uh, can't hurt. And yes, yes. Vinny is basically a closet on wheels right now, so... This one's rather bigger than the, uh... than the one that we're actually flying around in now. Unknown infestation types, probably two would be my guess. So, okay. It sounds like one of the infestation types is swarm. There's a ship defense.
get Vinny out of the way. Wait for the slime spawn. Though provoking the slime spawn in R4 would really make the most sense, but I was a moron, so I didn't do that. Let's just make sure that has defense on it, shall we? No, it has ship scan. Okay. Hmm. That's decidedly inconvenient. Okay. All of a sudden, I'm really glad that I brought re reroute power. Okay, so now we know the infestation types. Well, actually no, because there could be a third. We don't have an airlock, so... And I totally didn't notice that there was fuel in there. Tiny little room D sixteen has has swarm in it. Okay. Using video signals, that's a bit of a drag. Slime, 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 slime. No, it doesn't look like there is. Is there in here? Okay. 
Doesn't look like it. We don't find another interface, though. We don't find another interface. There's no way we could commandeer this ship. Because we'll have no way to kill anything. That room has a vent in it. <sighs> Shit. Well, I don't suppose it matters all that much. Then shall we? Thank you. 
So I would like to at least have the option of commandeering this. Well... Seven fuel, two ship upgrade slots, and... Only 54 scrap capacity, actually, never mind then. <clears throat> that was a little bit less awesome than... than I might have hoped, but, um, yeah, let's get out of here. Okay, and we... Yeah, so much for the metalloid. Here's the Vagrant. See what the Vagrant has for us. No, and we don't need you. Yeah, yeah. And it's two infestation types on here. Wow, it's two infestation types, and we don't even get a starting safe room. Oh, screw you, game. Okay, well then. Time. out of here. And then we'll have to see what's in our seven. That's the only interface we found. So whoops. Oh, fucking boxes, as always. My favorite thing in the world. Oh, we don't need to worry about slime timers anyway. Let's just dock a three. Yeah, could actually dock a two. Oh, right, we also have remote power installed. about the damn boxes again. Okay. Yeah. At 
least we're not waiting on a slime timer or worried about a slime timer that's something anyway Come on, guys. Yeah, I actually figured that it was it was going to be that one first. Okay. No items of interest. One scrap for you, that sucks. And if we wanted to, we could commandeer it, but we would never do that because this isn't a very good ship. Okay, E3, D8, D6, and let's just end. get off this, not much, and stealth and interface are both deteriorating, which is less than ideal. We really don't want to lose stealth, because we don't have... of jump fuel after this, so we'd really only be visiting probably the Red July if we wanted to. I think we'll chance it, and if... I really like stealth, though. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. going to be big, there's going to be wear and tear. You know, screw it. No, I'm not going to fix it. We're just going to make do if it breaks. And same with the interface. I mean, the interface is the closest thing we have to an offense upgrade, because we can run turrets with it. But, um... And this is two infestation types as well. Nice tiny starting room. Oh, that's nice, though. Got the fuel right there. You can hear the swarms. Already a buzzing. giant room and Kyle has another scan
see if we get slime. doesn't appear to have worked. Oh well. Right. So again, we don't need to worry about slime timers. We know where the next generator is. Seven, shall we? There are much safer ways to do this than I was just thinking. Come on, Matt, out you go. Sounds like there's swarm in there, so for the time being.
Okay, open R9, pop A8, close R9. Hopefully this keeps any doors from breaking. Yeah. Really? That's mildly annoying. doing so far. Not a lot of scrap, but... There's another generator. Nothing nasty in here. Another damn generator. Okay, dock A1. Let's open D9. And we'll open D9, pop A8, close R9. Good. We have remote power. I keep forgetting that we have remote power. <laughs> okay. No, there is no reason to take that much risk. I was fairly certain that I had cleared this, but, uh... Oh, that's six minutes from now. Oh, and there was a ship defense. Oh, okay, D-13... Okay, seven. We will open a seven, and we'll just call ourselves done with this and hope the stealth didn't break. Yeah. Ah, I didn't open all of the doors. Stealth broke. Okay, we're going to be down to motion then. Five jump fuel, though. That's nice. Thing is, we don't have anything we can safely explore with. So, so no, we are not going to the Red July just yet. In fact, 
fact, we are jumping back here. Mine and motion. And that remote power, I think, was pristine before, but um, now it's not. They, do, they are selling a jump fuel, but uh, yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I think we need to jump back and, and clear the Icarus and hopefully find like a teleport or something. That's what we really need. Okay. The Red July, it's a medical C, it's going to be very tiny. That scan is breaking. Right. Vinny, you take the mine and Copper takes the motion. And let's do it. Bugged. Medical C with who knows how many infestation types then. Install it because we're morons. Okay, well, yeah. I think that might be our first sighting of slime, too. Just sort of curious. I know that was a swarm, I heard it. even worth visiting. Yeah. I mean, it's good to be thorough, but, um, sorry, copper. First damage anybody took this run. And the not all. Okay. Government B... Probably tiny as well. Yeah. What infestation type, though? Oh, wait, wait, wait. This place is actually going to be pretty big. Okay, let's pop D10. Okay. 
Okay, we found another generator, remote R4. We don't know what it is. And I kind of want to know what it is, so... Might be sentries, which would mean we would actually get some more scrap, which would be nice. I keep checking this just to make sure that, that I'm right about there being only one infestation type, but I am. like another damn swarm. scanner that we don't care about. Um, okay. We wait to see if a swarm moves in there, though we can also just listen, really. reason we would want to, but uh, it's nice to know that we could. Okay, so D18, D A3, and Right. 
scan is breaking, we have a backup and we have a probe. It's all fine. Medical B. And then we finish with the Wild Stallion. Okay. Yes. of the ship. Okay, well. It's starting to seem like a slime ship. Certainly feels like a slime ship. Okay, and pardon me, I'm going to step away for a moment. Okay, I'm back. So, time remote R10, because we have remote power. I keep forgetting about that. This is actually a very large medical B, all things considered. Okay, well, let's dock A3 while we're at it here. Oh, okay, so we don't need to worry about slime timers. Nice. Right? Right. Okay, that's happy. Dock A1, then. And this is a bit of a traffic jam here, so let's just begin again. And you got stuck behind Vinny. Right. Okay. Kind of wonder what's in there, but um, that moved quick. Doesn't sound like a swarm. I'm actually guessing that it might be a uh, might be a sentry. That would be nice because we could kill it with mines. And let's flag R14, R15, R15, R15. 15 and our 16 flag our 15 because we know those rooms are safe so d25 hello noah and another motion and another scan we have all the scans in the world this time
Okay. Well, let's check D15 first, shall we? happen there either, except we wound up towing fucking Vinny. I think Vinny, well, Vinny's a 120 point drone, but Vinny is sort of annoying me. I kind of want him on the scrap heap. Thank you. Is a vent, so maybe they're just very, very, very quiet swarms, but I don't think so. What? Oh, R5 was flagged because when I tried to flag R15 before, I did a typo. Right. Okay, well. D23 D5 and D18 Let's see if anything comes out of these Let's just see what this guy is, shall we? Found the fuel, that's nice. And another jump cell. And because it's better to be safe than to take a leaper hit in the face. than ideal. Okay, dock A1. And off you go. Right. We have two upgrade slots, one of them has a uh, decontaminate, so we probably don't want this ship, but... Um...
Yeah, these are definitely taking too long to be uh, to be sentries. Also, a direct hit with a proximity mine is something that um, that I'm fairly certain only a uh, a leaper would survive. I haven't fully tested that, but yeah, these are leapers. Come on, in you go. Your friend is just through that door in the north wall in the next row. Soon you'll be together. Reunited. We wouldn't want you to get lonely after all. Let's get you both into... No, not into R15, into R16. Come on. I'm not sure why I'm even bothering. Okay. Open R16, pop A3, close R16. Bye. And this is a ship that will be fit to commandeer should we so desire. Oh, except we forgot about our seven. Never mind. Okay. Uh, nav 1 R5 then. This was what? This was a medical B with one infestation type. Three leapers. I'd be very, very surprised if there was a fourth. But, um, could be wrong. Remarkably few ambiguous. Ah, there you go. D9. I will be very, very sad if it turns out that these were, in fact, sentries because. If there were sentries, I just pissed away like possibly 12 scrap, but um. Forty-two, two and five, the solid profit, um no. And ten scrap. Okay, so exit. And what do we have in the way of drones? You know, Kyle. Hate to say it, buddy, but, uh, is indeed the scrap heap for you. Well, 
we'll add proximity mines because that's always good. No sensors and the wild stallion. This has been a, uh, a long episode, I think, but I would like to get Icarus cleared so that we're done with that particular patch of galaxy. And we have four jump fuel. Maybe we'll have five by the end of this one. <sighs> Loadout is fine. We used a lot of motions, but... Um, yeah. Yep. It's fine, fine. And what do we have? Repairs and maintenance with a hold of heavy metals. I wonder what they're repairing that they needed heavy metal for, but... Uh, Ooh, Twinkie has a new stealth, so... Get to the back, please. Wow, Tweaky and John. Okay. This is definitely worth a price for the mission, I think. Really, and we lost a video signal for copper. That's annoying. Generator and a sonic. That's an incredibly worthless room. Just see what's going on in here.
another one. Let's just see if we got slime, shall we? Doesn't look like it, unless it just happened randomly somewhere, so... Okay, motion, D13, D16... Slime. Let's remote R9, remote R6. 
six. So there is a fourth generator in R11, and there's some sort of infestation in R11 as well. So remote R6, remote R2. Okay, fine. Come on, Leaper friend. Come on in here. Come on, come on. Okay, D7 and... jump fuel. And only one slot, otherwise we might take this for a ride. Well, no, we still need to have our military ship, so exit. How much should we get off this? 11 motion and remote power deteriorating, that's a bummer. Right, we have five jump fuel though, we've cleared out Icarus. So, I think... Hmm. Right. Well, I think we are going to call this part... What have we got here? Tweaky's quite good. Got all the generators in the world. Okay. Mm, 
vanilla. We're going to convert you to scrap. Vinny, we're going to repair you to full so you can actually, like, play now. And... Yeah, and whoever that was, we also converted into scrap. We should repair the transporter because we're going to be using it soon. Repair the remote power. Well, except we don't really need to do that, do we? We can just sell the, uh... Mm. Okay, um, we're not going to go to Nova yet. We are actually going to go back here and jump. motion is breaking quickly, isn't it? Can't hurt. And we'll have a backup, and we've used up some of our scrap. So, ship config... Choquius research, research, military, research. Okay, I'm not sure which of these we'll go to first. Um, this has 30 scraps, so we'll be coming back here just to sell stuff, if nothing else. So, okay. Um, yeah, that, that is all for now. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye.